All right, guys. This is uh, those who are having trouble um, installing this thing. Um, most of these on Amazon are generic, so this could work for multiple um, USBs. Um, so I know most of you, when it's not doing the uh, plug and play, first thing people like to do is go to Device Manager, which was not working for me. Would even pop up at all, and. Um, what I did is I found it to pop up under let's see here I found you go to devices then you go to devices and printers right here now for me it popped up as dongle or you know as soon as you plug in the USB and some weird thing pops up obviously it's gonna be that and most likely it's gonna have like a exclamation mark or something like that so what you wanna do is hit properties for me, it was trying to, Windows was trying to install the wrong driver. So, um, when you go to hardware here, you should usually have one device. Since, you know, this one's installed right, it has all this stuff. But you should have one device. Um, pick the one that is the correct one. So you're going to hit properties. And go ahead and hit change settings. It's going to let you hit driver and you want to go to update driver. Then the important part is you want to go to browse my computer files for drivers. Then you pick drivers available on the computer. So it's going to pick like a generic driver. So you're going to force your computer to install a driver. Now for me, it was trying to install the CSR reference endpoint because it's made by CSR but that was the wrong one now you can uncheck this and it'll give you a ton of options like this see it was trying to install this one by Cambridge Silicon Radio but you're gonna want to you can try these you can try this one but this was not working for me so I just went ahead and I used this uh, generic Bluetooth radio or you can do adapter but start with radio first and it should literally instantly install and if that doesn't work for you you can go ahead and un uninstall your device unplug it plug it back in and try something else before you go ahead into before you go ahead and return and return the uh, thing and you know they recommend that you install this Windows XP or if it doesn't work you install this th this thing the uh, software which sucks because you're limited to um, adding a Bluetooth device through this little thing right here and it pops up a little tiny window it's super old and lame and with the correct driver you're able to do it through Windows 10 and it's a lot more efficient and faster